We are! crescendo of noise, so much noise that at times it feels like the ground shakes. It is the whiteout at Beaver Stadium, as tonight the Nittany Lions and Ohio State square off in one of the more highly anticipated games of this 2018 season. The Big Ten Championship has run through this game the last couple of years. Many think it runs through this game this year. Now we get to watch the three and a half hour passion play play out. Delivers, Handler's got a 15, 20. KJ 25, 30. First sideline 40, and there he goes. KJ Handler 40, 30, 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown, Penn State, 93 yards. In a game where field goals have been the norm to this point, the game's first touchdown is an exclamation point. Penn State now has a chance here at the end of the first half. They put the pedal to the metal down here right now to continue. He fumbled the ball. Ohio State's got the football. Big moment now in this game. Haskins takes it. Pressure from the outside. Dumps it off the screen to Dobbins. Dobbins to the 10 to the 5. Touchdown, Ohio State. And they take advantage of the takeaway and get their initial touchdown in the game. Right now in this game, they've got all the momentum. They look to take the lead here in the third quarter with their initial drive. Dobbins left side. Cuts it to his right. Touchdown, Ohio State. Their first late of the night. And now Jack Penn State legitimately must respond for the first time yeah, tonight. Exactly, but also we've got to start converting right now. We are one for 13 against this Ohio State defense on third down conversion. Third and 13. Back goes McSorley. Steps up in the pocket. Delivers deep downfield. KJ Hamler. He's got it inside the 35. And down to the 30 yard line. And it's also going to be a penalty flag as well. Targeting here, called. And it looks like they're taking him to the locker room. Better, yeah. He's trying not to go to the locker room. Concussion protocol, he's got to. Yeah. McSorley takes it. McSorley back. He throws in the end zone. Touchdown! That's right. That fireball. And it trace we trust the Nittany Lions take the lead. Every time you need something, number nine produces it. And McSorley continues to run the football against his Ohio State defense. Straight ahead, left side he goes to the Ohio State 20 behind blockers to the 15 and shoved out of bounds. First and goal at the half yard line. 8-10 to go and roll it. Sanders pulls his way to the goal line. Touchdown, Penn State. So 6.58 to go in this game. 26-14, Nittany Lions. Next thing hand off, back to throw with pressure coming, steps to the pocket, fires middle of the field, great catch made at the 35-yard line, and it's Benjamin Victor curling to the left, middle of the field to the 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown, Benjamin Victor. 26-21, Nittany Lions, and now the pendulum swings back. So Dwayne Haskins will bring the Ohio State offense onto the field, first and 10 of their own four-yard line. Put a scoring drive here, make yourself a legend. That's right. Brings it on the right side, caught by Dobbins, who races to the 10, 15, middle of the field to his own 20. Cuts it back up to the 25, to the 30 goes Dobbins, and he is tackled at his own 40-yard line, J.K. Dobbins. Well, somebody needs to make a play. Third and five, 2.28 to go. This quick screen goes right side, K.J. Hill. He'll push it to the 20 of Penn State, to the 15. Right sideline and down he goes to the end zone. All right, so here's the deal. 2.03 to go. You need to get at least 50 yards to give yourself a realistic shot at a field goal to win it. Now this is where Ohio State dials up blitzes yeah. all the time yep. when you need to get a long way. Sorley to his right. He's got 50, 45, dives ahead inside the 45 and down at the 43, 42 yard line. Now it's going to be fourth down. 122 to go. Here's the ball game. Can the Nittany Lions keep this drive alive? McSorley with a snap. Hands to Sanders, and he is down at the 
45 yard line. Really? How about this crazy, crazy football game tonight? I'm pretty upset right now because I'm hurting for those guys in that locker room. The reality is we've gone from an average football team to a great football team, but we're not an elite football team yet. We lost yeah. to an elite program, and we're that close. We have gotten comfortable being great. We will no longer be comfortable being great.